Hello, my name is Gary Bain from The Wound Guy. I'd like to spend a few minutes talking about the meaning of the Woundiverse. I have been very fortunate to have spent nearly 40 years interacting with people who experience and live with wounds. Some individuals have a relatively simple and straightforward pathway towards healing. Others encounter the exact opposite, enduring wounds which significantly lower their quality of life. Complex, chronic and often undiagnosed wounds force people to endure issues such as pain, social isolation, mental ill health, financial harm, loss of function and physical capability. These problems also negatively impact upon loved ones and those who cohabitate with persons living with wounds. This is the dark side of the Woundiverse. The bright side is that the Woundiverse is increasingly being filled with professionals who offer knowledge, leadership, clinical expertise and compassion, all of which is directed at meeting the challenges brought about by wounds and their hard to heal variants. These individuals are our stars. The Wound Healing Organisations, our constellations. It seems that the Woundiverse works best when the patient and their significant others are placed at the centre of care. Where appropriate and realistic, they are empowered to be goal setters and decision makers, thereby determining expectations that their team can interact and work with. As the stars bring their unique skills to bear and the constellations support through information, policy and procedural guidance, a glorious galaxy evolves. The galaxy is something of beauty, colour and richness. It is dynamic, flexible, adaptive, cooperative and inclusive. Yet is always focused on its core, that person with a wound. In my mind, the Woundiverse is a place of giving, sharing, learning and relearning. Its base is science, research and evidence. Its actions are goal-driven, informed by comprehensive and perpetual assessment. Measurement and quantification describe the value of intervention. Repetitive evaluation is the Woundiverse's method of orientation. The Woundiverse is not a place of hierarchy, professional silos, nor ego. It belongs to all of us, and we each have a contribution to make within it. Just as a supernova, for a while our light will shine bright, but as it inevitably fades, so its brilliance must be replaced by another. Our Woundiverse must then be dedicated to teaching and the development of others who seek to uphold what it stands for, knowing always that it is the well-being of those confronting complex wounds who are the purpose of our existence. Thank you for listening.